1996, there was this rock in Antarctica, ALH 84001, which had tantalizing evidence for possible life, traceable not to Earth, but from Mars. The evidence was very circumstantial, but interesting nonetheless. So it was all the news, page one story. They even had an electron microscope photo of what looked like a bitty bitty worm. It was about one tenth the size of like the smallest worms on Earth. It had little segments on it. It's intriguing. That was not the lead evidence of the authors. I'm invited to comment on this. In fact, it was Charlie Rose. He had four people. I'm the astrophysicist. They had a biologist. And the picture of the worm comes up. The biologist who was piped in by a screen said, that can't possibly be life. I said, wow, what have I missed? So tell me, because the smallest life on Earth is 10 times that size. And I'm still waiting for him to give me the reason why it can't be life. Then I paused and reflected at that. That is the reason he's giving me that it can't be life. His comparison with life on Earth. And then I said, last I checked, we're talking about a rock from Mars. Why are you using Earth to constrain your capacity to think about what exists out there? 